I think it's important not to treat the new series like a greatest hits album, not to recreate, just do the same old tunes, but to treat it as a development. Mm. And to, you know, new stuff. Take that mock too. <laughs> Very much so, yes. I mean, you know, we always fancied ourselves as a boy band, and, uh, and here it is, I reunited it. together at last. Oh, exactly. Exactly. I think we were all quite uh, surprised, really, really surprised, by just how little time it seemed as if we'd been away. It was 14 years now since we, we last filmed Cold Feet. And after the read-through and the initial kind of insecurities about that, I think once we spent time together, it was as if we'd been away for a couple of months. Yeah, well, you have to kind of recap, because we've got teenage kids now, so the stories don't just revolve around the, the, the three couples, or, sorry, the single. Yeah, my wife died, yeah, thank you. I, I know. Yeah. I'm so sorry about yeah. that. Uh, so we've got to think of a bigger picture now, because our families are extended and a lot older, so they come into the storyline. So I was trying to, one of the things that I had to kind of do was backtrack, oh my God, what kids have I got and what age will they be and what might they be doing. Well, you basically had to read the script. Yeah. <laughs> well, I did, yeah. yeah. It doesn't, doesn't feel like a remake. It just, uh, no. what, what I liked about it, as far as my character is concerned, I don't know about the others, but it just feels he's sort of older but not wiser and still rubbish at life, which seems to be the key to it. The series, I think, is richer for the gap. It's more, more dense and we're still, we're less aspirational, we're older and we're still trying to cope with life. I think the stories are timeless, you know, uh, and the characters are incredibly accessible. I think one of the strengths of Kofi was that we did, we were familiar to, to an audience. Because I mean, we've known each other now for getting on for 20 years. We're sort of, there's a sort of grudging acceptance that we're inextricably part of each other's lives and it was sort of yeah, <laughs> enjoyably cool. accepting that. Listen, we're not going down a mine, we're not uh, saving lives, but it is a very big part of our life and it was part of other people's lives. Well, we do get on, we all get on great. And the thing is, if you have a camaraderie off camera, it can only help on camera.